Hey guys, welcome to another episode of Who, What, When, Where. Today we are talking all about beauty hacks for those of us that kind of want a shortcut or some new ideas on how to use basic everyday beauty items that you might just have laying around. What we are talking about are bobby pins, and I know every woman out there has a stash somewhere, a few in a drawer here. For those of us that are organized, they're in a bin there, but bobby pins are something that I think everybody has and has a use for from time to time. So we have three different situations on when to use your bobby pins. Number one is just to hold the hair up. That's your basic use for a bobby pin is to secure hair. But recently I read an article about spraying dry shampoo or hairspray on your bobby pins to make them a little bit more tacky. And I cannot believe that I did not know this before. It changes everything. There is no more slip in your bobby pins. You don't have to worry about them falling out. It just creates a little tacky texture so that things really hold in place. Tip number two is to actually use your bobby pins as a really fun accessory. If you have glittery or bold nail polish that you're really not sure what to do with, maybe you didn't like the way it looked on your nails, don't get rid of it. Actually paint your bobby pins with that color. You can use them to pull back the hair in a crisscross motion. You can just just slide one in on the side and they become a really beautiful hair accessory that you DIY'd yourself for next to nothing. The third tip is my favorite because I have so many tubes of primers, gels, toothpaste, anything that comes in a tube where you are looking to squeeze out that extra little bitty bit that you can never get to. Take your larger bobby pins, you know the ones that are really thicker in length and you're gonna slide that on whatever bottle you have and press all the product all the way down. This way you're not wasting any product. It helps you from being frustrated trying to get the product out, and I love this. I always have a bobby pin hanging around my toothpaste tubes in my medicine cabinet. So there you have it, three great uses for bobby pins, which we all have. I hope you guys enjoyed this. Give it a thumbs up if you do. Make sure you are subscribed so you don't miss any future episodes, and I will see you guys next Sunday. Mwah.